So I always start my sessions by hanging from a pull-up bar or whatever I can find that remotely resembles a pull-up bar. It just feels really good for your back, stretches out your lats. If you got tight lats like me, my overhead position sucks. Uh, hanging from a pull-up bar every day will really help you. But it makes me feel good before I squat. And uh, you really need that uh, thoracic mobility and you need your lats to not be so tight when you do high bar squatting if you want to keep that good position. So after I'm done with that, I just go into moving around with the bar, you know, five minutes maybe. I think today I did it for like roughly two minutes. I just get my ankles loosened up and then I'll put the bar on my back and spin around and do all kinds of weird shit. I just want to get my, my heart pumping and get the blood flowing. So I already know how I'm going to feel on my top set once I have this weight on my back. Every session, it doesn't matter. When I do my first set, I know if it's going to be a good or a bad day. Now, am I still going to put the weight that I plan to put on? Yes. But I know if it's going to move well based on how I'm moving and how I feel with the lightest weight. And I don't know if that's just me or if it's something that you can develop, but I think if you start paying attention, you'll know. Today, things were moving okay. I was in a decent posi position, even though the, the weight's light. And I felt good. So I knew that I was gonna put on 495 for my top pause. And I knew it wasn't gonna feel terrible. I knew it was gonna move decently. Um, I did triples all the way up until 405, as you'll see. Uh, you know, what I'm thinking about when I'm doing light weights like this, it's really staying in a good position, not letting my hips fly back. When you squat high bar, you don't want to squat like you're squatting low bar. You actually want to push your hips forward and get them over your toes. Keep your torso in a good position. Also, another thing that you'll see is I don't have the bar in my neck. A lot of novices, beginners, they think high bar means I need to put the bar as high as possible, but that just bends your neck forward and puts you in a really ugly fucking position. Don't do that. You look stupid. And I don't want you to look stupid because I care about you. So that moved decently. Put 455 on. It did not feel great. But when I look at the camera, it moved fast. So I said, I got to keep going up. Same thing here. This 475 didn't feel great. But I always come and look at the camera afterwards. And I'm like, I mean, it took like one second to come up. So top set goes on as planned. And you already know how this goes. It was the exact same way. So that's my workout for today.